Aquarius, it's Nicole. So we'll be working on your weekly read, your weekly love read for April the 7th through the 13th, 2019. What messages do we have for Aquarius? Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, April the 7th through the 13th, 2019. What messages for guidance do we have for Aquarius? Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. April the 7th through the 13th, 2019. We're going to tap into your energy, your partner's energy, and the outcome of the situation. April the 7th through the 13th, 2000. April the 7th through the 13th, 2019. This is for Aquarius. Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Messages for Aquarius. Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. All right. Eight of Swords. So there is some inability to take action here. Eight of Swords. Someone feels trapped. Um, two of Pentacles. It's causing you to be in balance or causing someone to be in balance. Nine of Wands here. Nine, ooh, nine, nine, nine. Two nines with the Two of Cups. So some of you guys are needing to overcome something. Gain your independence so that you can bring something into fruition. Your partner here may be moving towards something new, but that could cause some conflicts because that's Six of Wands with the Five of Wands. Seven from the Ace of Wands. There's a worry here. So you could be trying to hold on to something or someone could be trying to hold on to you. Either you're trying to hold on to something or somebody's trying to hold on to you. It's causing a lot of imbalances within the situation. There is a need to overcome a relationship. You need to overcome this. All right. So nine of wands here. First card out. This is about finding the strength to overcome. Knight of Pentacles, Four of Pentacles. Some of you guys are taking your time trying overcoming something because you're emotionally stuck, you're hurt, you're feeling in conflict here by something that has happened, a tower moment, something that has shaken up your world. Now you really needed to find the strength to really gain your independence, gain your confidence um, so that you can move forward. Why is this Knight of Pentacles here? Why is this Knight of Pentacles here? Ace of Pentacles. That's Ten Pentacles. Ay, ay, ay. So some of you guys are still holding on to a relationship. Ace of Swords, yes. Um, there's an unexpected opportunity here for you to be free or there's an opportunity. Some of you guys got to take the leap of faith to get there, but you're going to have to overcome and gain your confidence. That's why you got this eight of swords here. Some of you guys are afraid to take this leap. You're afraid to, to really move forward. Why is this two of cups here? Why is this two of cups here? Why is this two of cups here? Strength here, I'm trying to tell you. I'm trying to tell you. Some of you guys are trying to have patience, making a decision about a relationship, whether you're moving into one or out of one. Because I got the Knight of Wands. So some of you guys could be moving into a relationship, really needing to find the strength to get over whatever internal conflicts you have, whatever worries you have. Some of you guys could have some money issues, and that's why you're kind of trying to stay guarded within the situation. There's a movement forward. Um, some of you guys could be dealing with Taurus, Libra energy here. There is movement forward, but right now you're trying to have patience with the relationship. You're at a crossroads about what you're going to do. Um, <laughs> so let's see. Empress here. Why is this Empress here? Why is this Empress here? So some of you guys may be at a state of... Uh, where you're trapped in a relationship due to either some money issues, you may be holding on to something dealt because of money issues, four pentacles under here. This or someone that you're dealing with is, and you're deciding or they're deciding to take control of that. Mm -mm. The Empress here, because you're you're needing to overcome something, you or someone else is taking control of the situation moving forward. Now, Emperor, Empress. This is together. So you could be overcoming whatever fears you have, whatever anxieties you have, finding a positive resolution with someone to move forward. Taurus energy here because I got the Queen of Pentacles here. So some of you guys could be dealing with the Taurus and deciding to really take a leap of faith moving forward. They are the opportunity, but there is some conflicts around this opportunity. Why is this Ace of Wands here? Why is this Ace of Wands here? Five of Cups here. There's some disappointment. Somebody's needing to look at the situation from a different perspective. Yeah, someone needs to go within themselves. Um, your partner here may be having some slight disappointments. So either you're setting boundaries to a wife 
moving forward, moving toward a queen of pentacles here, moving to, toward nurturing yourself. They could be setting boundaries to you, moving toward nurturing yourself. The person that you're dealing with could be married and really trying to move, um, they're trying to move forward. There's conflicts, there's other people involved here, high priests, there's secrets, there's things going on behind the scenes. You need to over you and your partner here maybe need to needing to overcome some disappointments. Not a sword and take action. Why is this five of wands here? Why is this five of wands here? Why is this five of wands here? Nine of swords. Yeah. So the conflict is the anxiety. Six of cups of uh, things that you've dealt with in the past. Nine of wands here are still a need to overcome. So you and your partner here maybe needed to overcome a cycle. I don't know if you're overcoming the cycle and moving away um, because I do got nine pinnacles here, but it's separated. So you may be worried about money and your partner, the person that you're moving away from may be holding on to you. Hmm. Maybe guarded. Somebody could be guarded because of finances. Why is this might have two of swords here? So... The Knight of Wands is about, it's about moving forward. There's a swift moving forward, but it's also about being careful within your movements. So someone could be guarded, Ace of Pentacles, Ace of Wands here, and at a stalemate because they're trying to make sure that they're moving in the right. Now, if you're moving too fast, someone could be guarded against you moving too fast. That might be it. Someone could be worried and really guarded because this could be going fast. This is what's going on here. So you could be in a situation, you could be the one that is trying to put the brakes on a situation if it's moving too fast. Something is budding here. Do you have some internal conflicts because there's fear surrounding the situation? There's a mental restriction here. Why is this five of pentacles here? Emperor, yeah, you're worried, so you're guarded. You don't want to be hurt. That's what's going on. You don't want to be hurt. You need to overcome this. You need to go within yourself. Um, wherever you're moving to is emotional fulfillment. Hey, man, but you're in suspension here. Ten of Swords here, trying to embrace changes. Queen of Swords, you could be guarded because someone keeps asking you a bunch of questions. <laughs> or you are asking a bunch of questions about the situation. There's some guard here. You need to overcome being guarded within the situation. There's something beautiful that is brewing underneath here. But um, you're in balance here and you're in suspension. All right, so let's see what guidance we have. What guidance do we have for Aquarius? Sun, Moon, Rise, and Venus. Guidance, messages for Aquarius. Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. What messages do we have for Aquarius? Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. What guidance do we have? Messages for Aquarius. Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Aquarius. Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Right. Calling in your soulmate. Hmm. So you called in a soulmate. Um. This is what's going on. So you do have some issues in your family, or maybe there's something that you heal needs to heal, a family issue. Maybe you're just getting out of a relationship. Whatever it is, you need to be, like I'm telling you, extend your lighthearted energy to others. This is a past life relationship. This is a soulmate that you called in, but you're kind of guarded about connecting with this person um, on a deeper level, I'm guessing. Very soon, you're gonna have to decide what it is that you want. Very soon. Peace, y'all.